Challenges to type in butterfly with your eyes closed. Hey Moons, I'm going to show you guys on how to get 25 items completely free. Yes, all of these are completely free and they're all so pretty. Anyways, let's go ahead and get all 25 items now. Search up this game named Singapore Wonderland created by Visit Singapore and just simply join the game. Once you join in the game merely will welcome to the experience. Simply skip that part and now you will need to enter this portal named Garden Galaxy. Enter the portal. Now for you to be able to obtain the item you will need to collect all the blue scales scattered around map. This might take you some time as the map is a little big. Once you touched the scale it will turn transparent which means you already got it. Anyways you can keep track on how close you are by looking on the top of your screen. Collecting all the scales and reaching 100% should give you the badge. You will be able to get this item at Pancake Empire Tower Tycoon and this is created by Fidelity. Now you will need to go on the badges. In here look for the badge name choices. It will be this badge that you will obtain by depositing yum yums on the three magical creatures. Now you need to get the badgie again by deleting it in your inventory to be able to get the item because this is kinda glitched. Then join the game again after deleting the badge from your inventory and you should be able to get your badge. These are the three magical creatures where you need to deposit yum yums. Search up this game called Vita Coco the Coconut Grove or click the game link in my description to join this experience. Once you're in game go ahead to the sack where the arrow is pointing out. Talk to the NPC at the counter and just spam click on next till you see an X button. Now get out of the sack and follow where I go. Do not follow where the arrow is pointing. In here, claim your own tree nursery by clicking on E. And then plant the seed tree the NPC gave you a while ago. And from there you will get your first item badge, which is super easy. Click on the map. Then press on the volleyball icon. Now for you to be able to get this second item is to play volleyball and score up to 130 to 240. I got a score up to 140 and got the badge so I suggest scoring to 140 to be sure. Join on to this game Vita Coco the Coconut Grove and this is created by Vita Coco. Once you're in game, you will be seeing this newly added boards. Now for you to be able to get the item, is to follow a specific order. Follow these numbers on the screen and walk to the boards following the number order. This is very easy as you will only need to click on view on each board and press X when you're done. You will get the badge once you've finished following the numbering order. Join into this game named Pancake Empire Tower Tycoon and this is created by Fidelity. Now for you to be able to get this item is to feed the three creatures inside your tycoon. It will be these three magical creatures. And what you're gonna feed them is the yum yum you will gather. 
To get the yum yums is to buy a pancake and wait for it to throw the little circles. These little circles will be the yum yums. Collect them and feed it to the magical creature. It doesn't matter how many yum yums you feed on each creature. Feeding the third magical creature will give you your badge with the item. Go ahead and join into this game Blueberry Clothing Store created by House of Blueberry. For you to be able to redeem this free item is to finish the obby. The obby is pretty easy. Follow where I go inside the clothing store to get on the obby portal. I don't know why but I'm kinda laggy in this game. In here step on the button. It will take you into this small map with the Onby in it. Get into the ship without falling into the water and getting hit by the sharks. And there you will get your badge with the item. Search up this game named A Heartland created by eHeartRadio and simply join it. Once you're in game you're gonna need to claim on an empty studio slot. Next is to go talk to Jake where the arrow is pointing out. After that you're gonna need to farm on the sound field and convert the energy you got into coins on your studio. Buy your first radio then talk again to Jake. And there your task is to start gathering sound energy. For faster farming there's a concert here which will give you more sound energy. After that buy another radio. Talk to Jake to get the task on powering your studio. I got confused here and bought another radio which is not part of the task, oh I suggest following where the arrow is pointing. And from powering your studio using the sound energy go back again to Jake. You will need to buy your fifth radio on this. When you're done buying your fifth radio go back again to Jake. And then he will give you a task to get a new gear. I bought the cheapest one which only cost 300 coins. Then again deliver the gear back to Jake. Talk again to Jake and he will assign you to go to the State Farm neighborhood. Follow where I go to the portal. Go back again to the portal. Talk to Jake. Then last task is to open the gate. And for the last time talk to Jake and you should be able to get the item with the badge. Search this game called Pancake Empire Tower Tycoon created by Fidelity and simply join the experience. Now for you to be able to get the item is to buy the 1000 stack of pancakes. It might cost you a lot but it's pretty easy to grind and earn here. You can earn money by feeding the magical creatures or finish the obby. But I suggest focusing on feeding the creatures with yum yums. Buying the 1000 stacks of pancakes should give you your item with the badge. Join into this game named Pancake Empire Tower Tycoon and this is created by Fidelity. Now for you to be able to get this item is to feed the three creatures inside your tycoon. It will be these three magical creatures. 
And what you're gonna feed them is the yum yum you will gather. To get the yum yums is to buy a pancake and wait for it to throw the little circles. These little circles will be the yum yums. Collect them and feed it to the magical creature. It doesn't matter how many yum yums you feed on each creature. Feeding the third magical creature will give you your badge with the item. Join on to this game called Pancake Empire Tower Tycoon created by Fidelity. Now for you to be able to get this item, is to claim 3 finished tasks in the Book of Recipe for Success. Claiming your third task will give you the item with the badge. Now on the 3 steps that I did is pretty much easy. First task is to buy 10 pancakes. The second task is to play or stay in the game for 5 minutes most easiest on the task actually. Third I unlocked the fourth tier of pancakes in the recipe book. And from that I was able to get three tasks done in the book of recipe for success. Search this game named Twice Square created by JYP Official and simply join the game. After you join you will see this pop-up saying on how to get the free hair. Says here that you will need to find all the letters to spell twice to earn the free hair. And of course I'm going to show you guys the location for each letter, so let's go ahead and obtain this. For the next two letters go ahead and teleport to the twice pier. Follow where and what I do in the ferris wheel. Jump here. And the last letter will be here. Getting the last letter should give you the badge with the item. Join into this game named Singapore Wonderland and this is created by Visit Singapore. Now for you to be able to get this item says here that you must spend one hour cumulatively in the game. So basically all you need to do here is to stay in game for one hour. You can track on how much time you have stayed in the game on the right side of the screen. You can just be away from keyboard or get that other UGC that you haven't obtained yet. By the way it's cumulative so your progress will still continue if you left and rejoined the game. After spending one hour should give you your badge with the item. Go ahead and join on to this game named NARS Sweet Rush and this is created by NARS. Now once you're in game you're just gonna need to hit the dice for you to be able to move around the map. To get the item you must collect 10 style assets that are in the game board. The style assets are gonna be the accessories along the way that you must buy. 
You're gonna be needing coins to be able to buy the style assets. You don't need to worry on where to get the coins as there will be a mini game pop up every 2 minutes that you can join in to earn coins. Just join in the mini games, finish it and you should be able to get coins from winning. The assets aren't that expensive and you will also be able to get coins along the way. Collecting all 10 assets should give you the badge with the item. Search up this game named NHL Blast, created by NHL official Roblox group and simply join the game. Once you're in game you will see this for task on your up left screen. That will be the task you need to do to be able to get the badge and the item. Follow where I go to finish the first to task. In the locker room you must equip a jersey any jersey you like and put a number on it. Click on the numbers and just put in any number you like on your jersey. Then equip and finally hit on exit. For the last two tasks this is what will take you time to finish as you will need to score 30 goals and tag 20 people. To get a goal you must reach the enemy's base and hit your goal without getting tagged. And to tag people you must hit them twice. Finishing all for tasks should give you the item with the badge. Search up this game named Beyond Land created by Falcons Beyond and just simply join the game. Now for you to be able to obtain this item, is to find Kilgore in the hidden realms beyond the portals. Or collect the three goggles on each of the three portals held by Kilgore. I'm going to show you guys on how to get it in each realms. Anyways there is no specific order for this challenges, so you can do it any order. Enter the Volcano Deathrin portal. For this challenge all you need to do is reach the bottom of the volcano. Don't worry on getting lost as there will be arrows along the way. And also be very careful on the falling boulders and the very thin paths. And finally when you reach the very bottom don't go to the finish line instead turn left right over here. Collect your goggles then put the challenge. The next challenge will be the space zombie survival which I think is very easy. Once you're in the map go ahead and find this red flag. I spawned just beside it so I took my goggles. Pretty easy. And lastly is the treehouse challenge. In here just simply follow where I go and be very careful in the obby. And Kilgore will just be right here so just collect your last goggles and from there you will get the badge. Search up this game called Fashion Closet and this is created by Carly Kloss. Carly Kloss just added a two new free UGCs in the game. Now on how to get the first UGC, you will need to like 100 looks on the runway. The quest is called Ultimate Fan. On how to finish this quest faster is to go on the global runway. It's gonna be the portal on your left.
On the global runway there will be a stage where the models are gonna walk. To like them simply press like button on your top screen. And it will notify you if you like to look. Continue your process till you finish the quest. You can keep track on how close you are on getting your badge by clicking the track your quest on your left screen. Liking a 100 looks will give you your badge and the item. This took me about an hour to get which is a little long. Join on to this game named Beyond Land and this is created by Falcons Beyond and Freeground. To obtain this item you must place 10 track parts in your lab. First thing you will need to place is the roller coaster. Place it anywhere you like. And then simply place in the tracks till you get the item with the badge. Go ahead and search up this game named NHL Blast and this is created by NHL official Roblox Group. Once you're in-game just go ahead and get into the circle at the center. Press on Join Game to get started. Now it will take you here. Just go ahead and play this game. I didn't really know how it worked so I just played it hee hee. Get into the enemy's base and shoot your goal to get X. You can also hit the enemy to get extra EXD. After 5 minutes the game will be done. I didn't win this but that's okay as long as you get points to reach level 2. Press on exit if you reach level 2 to get back on the lobby. Equip the golden helmet tot you got by reaching level 2. And then go here to take a picture. Click on the green button and from taking a picture you should get your badge. Join on to this game named Twice Square and this is created by JYP Official. They updated on how to get the new hair and to get it you must find and collect one collectible to obtain the hair. Every minute a collectible will spawn in the map. And for you to find the collectible easily is to use the detector. The closer you get to the item the faster the detector will blink and make sound. Also, the collectible is very small and also disappears at a certain time, so make sure to get it fast. Collecting the collectible that you find should give you a badge and simply go into the catalog marketplace. And then into the accessories. Set your sorts to recently created and the price filter to zero. And from there you will see this newest free parrot fish face item. This item says here will only be available till June 15th of 2023. The item looks a little weird but the special effects are very pretty. Join on to this game named Singapore Wonderland created by Visit Singapore and simply join the experience. Now once you've joined in game you will need to go to the finder's aisle portal. Of course Merely will talk to you, just skip that part. Now for you to be able to get the UGC is to find the location where the ferris wheel is. Use the detector to find it easily, you can just simply click on it and the beeper will show on your screen. The detector will light up once you're close to the item, 
The light will blink faster when you're really close to the item. This is where I found mine, but take note that the location is different for everybody. Join on to this game named Beyond Land and this is created by Falcons Beyond and Freeground. Now for you to be able to obtain the item, is to collect all 10 bolts scattered around the park. These are the locations of the bolts. Getting the last bolt should give you the item with the badge. Join on to this game named Singapore Wonderland and this is created by Visit Singapore. Once you've joined in game go ahead and enter the jungle jiffy portal. Now for you to be able to get this free item is to finish 5 games of go-kart racing. The race is pretty easy, you don't really need to place first as long as you finish the whole race it will be counted. And that's pretty much it just complete 5 of the go-kart racing and you should get your badge with the item. Go ahead and join into this game named Escape Running Head and this is created by Monado48. Now once you join in game you will see this portal called a special stage. You're gonna need to get in there. Now it will take you here which you need to finish or reach the stage to be able to obtain the item. Follow where I go to reach the stage easily. Always follow where the red is pointing, if you see one of these arrow it means you're on the right path.
Reaching the stage or the finish line should give you your badge with the item. Anyways have you moons obtained all of these already? If not go ahead and get them now before it goes off sale. See you all next time.